name is Thomas Sloan, and I'm an intern here at High Open Pictures Entertainment Studios. Um, let's see, I've been an intern for coming up on four months now. Um, I have gotten to watch horror movies. That's been really fun. They're interesting because I don't normally watch horror movies, so it's kind of cool to see how the other side lives, I guess. Um, I tend to find horror movies really scary, so uh, kind of, you know, being forced to watch them, it put me out of my comfort zone, which is probably for the better because I've learned a lot from the horror movies that I've watched. Like, um, I Like High Tension, directed by Alexander Haja. Uh There was one day, it was like the second day of being an intern, where all of us came outside and we were asked a series of, like, questions, in which I found out that I, before coming here, I knew nothing about film, nothing about any directors or actors or the history of film. I didn't know anything before coming here. Uh, every time I got a question, I got to do 10 push-ups. So needless to say, I did, I did many, many push-ups that day. Do I, I don't regret, I don't regret doing the push-ups um, because it was a learning experience and I've continued to learn. Um, since being here, I've learned uh, names of actors, directors, and studios that I probably would have never known previous to coming here. Um, and I have actually gotten to see the history of film, so I can actually see um, where my art comes from. Fight Club is up there, but so is, um, so is, uh, sp not Speed. Spawn? Spawn. I think one of the best things I've learned while here that I'll take with me for the rest of my movie career is how to work with others. Um, between me and the other two interns, we've had to work as a team throughout this entire experience. There's never been a point where we were just like on our own and didn't need anyone. Um, the other intern, Nathan and, and Cody, they both have more experience than me, both with Vegas and behind the camera. So. Uh, they've helped me out a lot, and uh, I've also learned that you never stop learning. There's always something new to learn. There's so much out there that you're never done learning. Yeah, yeah, I like my fellow interns. They're like, we've, through the, like, interning, we've become friends. We go to lunch every day, and that's when we kind of get to break to, you know, joke around or whatever. Not that we don't do that while we're working, but... <laughs> It's kind of funny, uh, you know, if you could see like the bloopers behind the scenes and stuff, especially during our comedy week, that was the best. Um, no, yeah, it's just been great. The, the guys are great, and uh, I hope I get to work with them a lot in the future. If I become staff at Iowa Pictures, I want to take it to the next level. I want everyone in this area, from Toledo to Wausau to Archibald to Defiance, I want them to know the name Iowa Pictures. And I just, I think that we can only get bigger and better, and every year, uh, we should be churning out new movies, bringing in uh, new people, bringing in new interns, and uh, so hopefully, like, we can start to like, you know, open up franchises and just. I, I just want everyone to know the name I Open Pictures to is we're, um, if not the only, we are the biggest studio around here, and it's a great opportunity for everyone. And um, I just hope that we can take it into like a golden age. Uh, the owners have been very helpful when they can. Uh, with opening uh, Sig Illusion, obviously they have a lot of responsibilities, but between my fellow interns and them, I've never just had a question unanswered. And um, now that we're getting into the more serious filming with, uh, with the dramas and the, and the horrors, uh, they've definitely stepped up their game and like actually come on set and helped us learn how to be better behind the camera and how to get better angles and you know how to get better shots and how to edit the video better so it uh, puts out a better picture so um, and what's great is uh, if and when us interns become staff that'll be all the more people that'll be able to help future interns so that way there's never someone who doesn't get a question answered and they're just kind of stuck you know what I mean so um, I really hope that I get to be a part of helping out and pictures grow and that we take it to a whole nother level and like I said, I want everyone to know the name out and pictures because I think that um, there's great potential 
here and uh, for our future and um, with us interns if and when we become staff the ideas that we already wrap around between each other and uh, future people coming in the possibilities are endless and bigger and better we're just going to keep rising so expect us yes. we're coming all right that's uh, right. Who's your movie so far um, it's almost a, my my favorite movies from Iowa Pictures is almost a tie between uh, The Dead Will Rise Two and Frankenstein. But Frankenstein has got to take the cake, um, just because the actors put on such a show. Like it was a very well written movie. Um, it was very artistically done, and um, and you can tell that they put like a lot of time into it. It it was not only just the actors' performances, but their level of Readiness. You can tell that they had practiced before they went into shoot. They had gotten, you know, A through Y done, and then Z was on set. They only, you know, they had everything perfect by the time it was time to shoot. And so uh, then when I got to see behind the scenes, you have, I actually got to see how um, months before they were even ready to shoot, they were getting ready and testing out makeup and how to make Frankenstein. Uh, how to make Frankenstein look how he did in the movie, which was really cool because it was just you know simple household household items, um, and so uh, I think Frankenstein because it was directed by Jordan Sawfield, it makes me excited to see what's going to come out next from Jordan because uh, it's been a while since he's come out with anything, so it's going to be pretty cool to see what he's like on an actual set uh, with you know future movies coming up. So uh, it was close, but Frankenstein is definitely my favorite from my pictures.